friends, welcome to another episode of our channel, we are discussing Kendall Jenner, who looks glowing when spotted out Larry Hoover concert in Los Angeles with Flame Devin Booker, watch this report, share with your friends, and we're coming with a lot more to share in this video. Kendall Jenner and Devin Booker made up a small fraction of the stars that were in attendance at Kanye West and Drake's free Larry Hoover concert in Los Angeles on Thursday night. The socialite and her NBA beau maintained a considerably low profile as they left the gig, which was held in an effort to free Larry Hoover from prison and raise funds for prison reform organizations. The model oozed radiance in all black, accentuating her concert attire with black leather gloves and a shiny shoulder bag. Her glossy raven tresses were coiffed with a hint of wave and in typical Kendall style, she ensured her makeup was nothing short of effortless. Meanwhile, basketball sensation Devin maintained a low profile, sporting a safety covering, hoodie and oversized jacket. His socialite girlfriend later joined him in the mask wearing as the pair headed out of the LA Memorial Coliseum. But before moving on, please subscribe our channel, and hit bell icon, so you'll never miss any update. Kanye and Drake alongside a slew of other stars, have been advocating for the release of Hoover, a former gang leader who was convicted of murder in the 1973 and is currently serving a life sentence. Among members of the Kardashian clan, stars included Megan Fox, Machine Gun Kelly and Lizzo, gathered at the outdoor stadium for the $10 million show, which Kanye dreamed up, putting his differences with Drake aside in a bid to help Hoover, following his meeting with Donald Trump in the same capacity. Kim was spotted in the venue with her and Kanye's daughter North, 8, Sun Saint, 6, her sister Kendall Jenner, sister Kylie Jenner's ex Tyga, her mom Kris Jenner and Kris' boyfriend Corey Gamble. Kim's presence at the gig was particularly poignant as Kanye referenced his ex while he performed his hit Runway, adding a new verse, directed at Kim, saying, I need you to run right back to me. More specifically, Kimberly, Kim filed for divorce in February after six years of marriage yet Kanye has made several public and increasingly bizarre bids to reunite with the stunner in interviews and on stage. Kanye previously made his case to free Hoover on a track on his recent Donda album where he had a voice recording of Hoover's son Larry Hoover Jr. thanking him for bringing attention to his father's case. Back in 2018, Kanye had asked then-US President Trump to pardon Hoover but the request was not granted. Regardless, Kanye and Drake continued the fight as they delighted fans with an energetic concert which saw them perform separately. However the biggest thrill for diehards no doubt was when Kanye performed Drake's 2010 hit Find Your Love which he produced. Kanye then played his own 2008 hit Can't Tell Me Nothing when Drake joined him on stage before the Canadian crooner carried on with his solo set. He delighted fans with older hits from his catalog including Jesus Walks, All Falls Down, and Gold Digger. The two then finished off the show together as they did one of their few hits together, 2009's Forever, which was off of the More Than A Game soundtrack. 